Hello guys, I'm a dolphin and welcome to some Master of Orion goodness. I'm your host, Master of Awfulness, and today we're gonna give you guys some more of that toaster versus cockroach action that you come to love and know from this Master of Orion Let's Play. So far, we got no money. Because we got no money, we can't retrofit. So that angry comment I got in the last video, uh yeah, you're not gonna get your retrofit. Also, you're you're adopted, bam. I got you there. So Let's go into the next turn and ooh, ooh, we got 17 ships coming at us. But look, at the, no bombs. What? How are they gonna attack us? Exactly. So right now our ships are really, really underpowered. Like I mean, they could kill us. They can kill our ships easy. The reason why they haven't is because we've just been maneuvering better than them. So right now we need to change our uh, vessels to having ion pulse beams because they're directly countering us by getting out ion pulse beams. So less Mercolite missiles, obviously. More ion pulse beams. You dig? You dig? Uh, let's get six mass drivers now. And again, ion pulse beams. There we go. Roach has the ion pulse beam. The, the, the whole Hydralis already has the ion pulse beam. You see that? Look, he's already covered. Choose research. Alien psychology or alien management center. Alien psychology. We want to know how to deal with our enemy. We're probably going to destroy their civilization, so there's no point in managing them. Look how much money we need. You know what? At this point, tax the population. I don't give a shit anymore. 171 ducats for me. That means uh, more survivability in the future. Now if I get out a missile base, I can uh, increase the defensive capabilities of this planet by a fuck ton. These ships have healed up. We will try and zerg rush our way to this planet. The only way we can ever win is by trying, and I do mean this sincerely, trying to somehow. Ooh. Could just fight it. I'm trying to choose who to attack, and right now I gotta pick the weakest targets. Come on, hit him. Keep hitting. Should have been maybe uh, focusing on really weak targets at the start, actually. If we play our cards right, we could probably get uh, the star base to live, actually. Ooh. And now our goose is kind of cooked. Get out of my house, bitch. Wow, we just destroyed the entire Mechlar fleet with a defensive force. I'm loving that. But um ba 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 I'm loving it. Get out of here, fool. You guys ever see Naruto? Or Naruto? Ya fool! I love Killer B. I'd have sex with his fucking dead corpse if need be. Let's attack that military outpost though. Why are we gonna attack the military outpost? We gotta show them that we dominate. Ya fools. Whoa. 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 Look at that. Whoa. Okay, go crazy. Go like that. Bam. 
Bam, 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 bam. See that? That was a one-two punch. We're gonna win this. Ah, oh, circling was destroyed. No, the really weak unit was destroyed. All right, buddy. Let's talk. Let's talk. What? What? You don't want to talk? Why would you not want to talk to us? We're so nice. You know? How can you do that to us? How can you do that to us? How can how can they do that to us, guys? Do I not have my hydrolisk yet? When is that being built? Damn. Taking centuries to build. I'm gonna keep taxing my population until we get enough money to retrofit all these guys. We can't get into a battle with their forces until we have enough cash. We don't have cash. We can't win in an engagement. I don't know if you guys understand, but we're poor. We're like actually poor. Like I don't mean like your uncle can't afford that nice little toy for Christmas for you, Johnny. Like I mean we can't even feed our fucking dog. We have to eat the dog now, you know? No, we're poor, man. I'm just really glad we managed to destroy their fleet because if we didn't, we'd be fucking dead. 189 ducats. I'm calling it ducats now because ducats sounds cool. Neutron Collider's done. Star base is being built. Loyal, smart, appreciate it. We need so much credits for a fucking retrofit. Oh my god, I'm going insane. And because most of my population is unhappy because of taxes, we're not gonna get shit. Might as well, I guess, get Colonial Revenue Services. Oh yeah, let's just get more money from the populace. Oh, oh, oh. How about we go and get ourselves- We need a military outpost here, actually. So that we can stop them once and for all from uh, attacking us. Could upgrade the Zerglings right now. Oh. Now everything's a little bit more expensive. Right, Galactic Trading is done, which means we can finally get something cool. But, let's see. Hold on a sec. Hold on. Let me get the boop boop. Robo Miners. Could get artificial planet creation. Oh, man. Oh, man. I don't know what to do. Let's get ourselves heavy armor. You know what I would like in this world? A star base. Not because I'm a fucking queer and I love stars and bases. Like, I'm talking about a star base where we can trade with the savage aliens and then we can, like, you know, um, give them a virgin for some blasters. I don't know. What's the conversion between virgin and blaster? Do you need one virgin, a virgin for, like, three blasters? Why did I say virgin right there? Sometimes... When I talk, I think of something, and then what comes out of my mouth is some incoherent nonsense. Granted, more, more coherency than most, like, YouTube comments, I suppose. Because that shit is like, oh, that's where knowledge goes to die. Look at that, so close. Oh! One more turn. Oh! There's their fleet, by the way. That's their entire fleet, right there. Took them a while to build that up because we destroyed everything. They only have three colonies, so they can't produce that fast. Okay, upgrade time. Ooh, very nice spanking looking. Now time to wait for Zerglings, and then afterwards we'll drop the taxes, obviously. Here, let's talk. A waste of a minimum viable wow. Wow. How about you give me 2,000 of your gold, buddy? And then share my charts. And that's and then we'll call it a piece. Four, zero. 
minimum viable. See, here's the thing. He knows he can kill me. He knows it. He knows I'm a bug. And he can crush me. I've just been getting really lucky. And if I fuck up, if I attack him at the wrong time, at the wrong place, he got me by the balls, you know? He he grab or he grabs onto my like nutsack and he just like tugs. He just tugs. And it hurts, man. It hurts. There's nothing I could do. It's a threatening fleet incoming, but you know, there's nothing I could do. It's a scout. I can at least keep track of this fleet. Six bombs. Not nice. Lots of scouts. Holy shit. Is this like a furry convention? Why are all the scouts coming to we me now? The Legion. Um, this is for your reinforced hull. We love the Legion. Now then, we need to get something that would aid us economically. Or we could just get more military tech into maybe shields. Let's do that instead, because who needs... Let's get jump gate, actually. That'd be useful. Mostly because we need to get a teleporter from this planet, or this planet over to this planet. That'd be nice. That would be nice. Two thousand. Two thousand. Do I look like I'm made out of two thousand? I'm at least made out of like a dollar. Like you can buy a Master of Awfulness at the 99 cent store. Honestly, I told my little bro this, but you can do what Master of Awfulness does with a 20 with twenty dollars worth of like, I don't know, recording equipment and a Bible. You need the Bible, however, because if you don't read the Bible, then the comment section on YouTube will affect you. <gasps> it's Bowser! Now before the hierarch of the Sacra Blood. Threaten not my progeny, and you and yours may live on. Hey, um, whoever, whatever neckbeard, um, gets the right answer for this, actually, I don't even know the answer for this, but, whichever neckbeard is a big fan of Master Ryan, can you guys tell me, uh, what characters Mark Hamill voice acts, because that would be wonderful. Toxic processor. <gasps> no! We have space for ships. Why don't we build ships? We do need to, we did need to take down the pollution, however. Well, look at that. They've built up a seriously strong fleet. However, I'm retrofitting my fleet, so we're good. Look at that. One more turn. One more. Can we survive for one more turn in our stupid endeavor to, um... Tax the fuck out of our population. And I think we can. I think we can. Retrofit. Right now. Ooh, damn, Daniel. Now, there we go. Bam. Right in the kisser. Back to the normal taxation. Yeah, I get it. We're poor. I understand. But you know what? You don't have to come to my house the day of my daughter's wedding and insult me. Oh, we really do need to clear down the pollution shit. Hold on a second, let me, uh... Ooh, what do I want? This is for your consideration. It's either more research or more production. Hold on. You have moons. Alright. So one plant has moons. Only one plant has moons. So, because... Oh, two plants have moons. Three plants have moons. We could get science from them. But that's the pansies way out, and these are mostly production planets, so... We'll orbital shit, uh, shipyard, or shityard, I was about to say shityard. In fact, we'll call it orbital shityard. Trade goods, because there's nothing we can really do here. Should really try and terraform that planet. I get it, I get it, we're building a toxic processor, it's gonna happen. Alright, thanks buddy. Thank you so much, friend. I am indeed friend of the guy over here. He is nice guy. 10 out of 10. Next time he talks, I'm going to fucking shave his balls off and eat them like a casserole. Um, What do you want? A little shit yard would be nice. I plead for a All right, don't show this again.
Wow, 1%. Only 1%? Wow. Okay. Clear out the pollution, I suppose. I want to get out one more hydralisk, but... Seems like Dad won't let me. Doesn't matter. Our fleets are strong enough to take on whatever they throw at us. We now finally have retrofitted our fleet so that we can actually take on the, um... The bad guys over here. I mean, they have 16,000, uh, power, but we have, like, 31,000, so... We're already kind of more powerful than them. We could just build a Hydralisk here, but, eh. Remember that production goes into our credit production, so... If we get more production, we can thus get more credits if I do trade goods. By the way, the Bowser's Empire is massive. Will of the Legion. Woo! This is for your consideration. We can scout out what's going on over here. So we got ourselves a good old fashioned couple of troop transports and a destroyer. Now here's my idea. We could just bypass this fleet. And just go for the capital. Go for the kill. The hive devises. Alright, you. Go over here, stat. One more turn and then we'll go back to hydroless production. I'm gonna rush it out with a buyout. Yeah, maybe next turn we would we would be able to do that. Yes, we will. Wow, 54. Holy cannoli. You know what? Fuck the pollution. We're just going to spam out Hydralisk. Actually, fuck the Hydralisk. Boy, it's time for some Zerglings. Buzz. We're gonna we're gonna really build up our fleet and then we're gonna just destroy him. He has three colonies. He can't build a lot of vessels. We're gonna out we're gonna like overwhelm him. It's gonna be insane. Arriving at the Wow, thirty two credits, thanks. This strife is wasteful. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll wait. He's scared now. He's scared. See he should have accepted my peace deal earlier. I mean granted, he's kinda fucked because I'm I'm on the warpath. Like I want blood. You don't understand. I want blood. I want him to bleed. I want to see the robot die. You know how there's no war in Bossing Say? There's no peace in the Mechlar Empire. I will destroy their race from the entirety of the cosmos. I will paint the skies with the fallen Mechlar children, whatever they may be, those mutant fucking robots. You know, we're banning AI. Period. No more AI. You guys are fan of the uh, you guys are fans of the culture series? Guess what? No culture. Bam. No minds. No nothing. Keep building your destroyers. Keep keep building them. Watch what's about to pop up from uh Gef too. Watch, just watch, 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 watch. I will let them build as much up as possible. Someday we will take out that. Now we have all these gravity worlds uh, suited up and ready to go. You know what I'm thinking? We can now get it soon a colony ship and colonize these two planets, and it would be very, very profitable actually. Speed up that. Look at that. My power is now 43. What's your power? 20,000. We're double your strength. What are you going to do about it, huh? You fucking animal. This is it. This is our... You know what? Wow, our chances are only... Half? Are you kidding me? Why? Maybe it's... Maybe we still don't have a lot of ships. And also, there's probably a lot of defenses here, actually, now that I think about it. If I attack this planet, I would actually win. Mechlon Prime. Yeah, 
here. I think I have an idea. I think we'll go to Mech on Prime while they're distracted. They don't know where we're coming from. We may be able to get a chance at uh, striking them. Just nobody tell them. Nobody tell them, okay? Nobody tell them what we're doing. Ah, oh, fuck, they know. They fucking know. They fucking know! Who fucking told them? Who's the shit who told them? Was it you, Darth Panzer? What's the point? What's the point now? They told. They told them. They did, my subscribers betrayed me. Now look at them. Now they're over here, Mechlon, jerking off. Yeah, that plan is just hard to crack. I'd love to develop our science, but you know what? We need more warfare, and we need more uh, DACA. We need more DACA. Get out some destroyers. I think that will uh, teach them a lesson. Yeah, just the military arms race to see who can build up the biggest fleet. And as soon as we're done building up that fleet, we're going to go ahead and go into some uh, massive research, like R&D. Wow, 5,000. What am I going to do with 5,000? 5,000! You know how much porn I can buy with 5,000 credits? I'm going to try it again. Hey, Maclar. No, I have an excellent idea. Why don't we just, like, I don't know, split up our fleet? That's a good idea, right? Actually, if we split up our fleet and then they're able to take advantage of that, no, that's not a good idea. This strife is wasteful. No. No, there's a reason why I want you to go into production mode over and over and over again. Because here's the thing. I'll win the late game. I have the most powerful planet here. You don't. What, what do you got? Here, it's time we get out some research. Well, look at that. 55,000 strength in one fleet. Now that's beautiful. We're pushing out. It's do or die. Oh! They left the safety of their fucking defenses! Those fools! And time now to colonize. Hydroponic farm. Actually, no. Get a cloning center. Get that. Rush it out. Bam. Done. Done. Easy. Easy. We won. Yeah, what's the point? You just made our life easy. Oh, uh, of course they're gonna fucking... Uh, if we attack... See, if we destroy their navy here and now, we would win. And we have a good odds of winning, actually. We could just attack. I think we could do this.
what they got pulse on missiles ion pulse beams and proton torpedoes damn it I don't got ion pull I don't got pulse on missiles what do I got I got Merc light missiles Whatever. Beam accuracy. Alright boys. Actually, hold on. Gotta click on all these vessels to see if they have the right radius. Alright, time to go into overboard mode. Fire away! Split up the force! Take it all out! Close quarters combat is here. Weapons free. Targets are hot. Mass drivers are destroying these guys in uh, up close and personal engagements. Yep, their fleet has been annihilated by superior numbers and uh, tactics. Okay, maybe not superior tactics, but they did have pulse on missiles over us, so they did have a technological advantage. It doesn't matter, though. Um, winner, winner, schminner, dinner. You know? So, yeah. Let's all uh, attack Melcon Prime, I think. In fact, you know what? We will do that in the next episode, actually. As I gotta call it quits for now, it is very late and I did not expect to be um, playing for so long. So, Das Lasagna, take care and remember to eat your vegetables, kids. Bye bye.